floor for the visiting team. At forward, Wesley Matthews. It's time to introduce the starting five for your home team. At forward, six and six. Number 24. It'll be the Wizards off the tip. Now a look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. Matthews out there with Aaron Gordon. Then it's Kevon Looney. And it's Christopher in at the two. Really unacceptable letting Porzingis get that kind of positioning. Once he's established, it's over. Here's Highland following the bucket by the Wizards. Chalk up two there. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now, here is Morris. Outside, Brzingis tries it from 19. Nice spin off the left rim and in. The reflexes on Porzingis can surprise you. For a big, he plays with great quickness. And staying healthy for Porzingis has been a challenge over his career. Not uncommon for players standing well above seven feet. Here's Kispert. Kicks to be Elbow shot. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. And in New York, even before his injuries, the front office voiced concerns about Porzingis' ability to stay healthy. Well, the, the track record for the players, 7-2 and up, not great. And, and today's game demands more movement from big men than ever before. Beautiful location on the pass, as usual. Led his man perfectly. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively. For sure. That's the pass Wesley you want. Matthews. Orchestrating the offense, creating for others. Now the pass to Morris. Back to Beal. And it's Josh Christopher with the foul. Josh That's his first foul. First and right now, foul. let's watch that terrific first swing. Foul. And right out of the gate, trying to set the tone defensively, you got to love that energy. Here in the first quarter, with about two minutes gone by, Pass to Kuzma. The Wizards working the ball around now. Shot clock at five. Shoots from the high post. And he hits the jump shot. And there's not an area on the floor where Beal can't do damage. He is a handful for any defense he goes up against. Away team foul. Bones Island. First personal foul. Here's Beal. Second team foul. He kicks it to Morris. Passes it to Kispert. He dishes it to Beal. And here's Porzingis. Defended by Looney. Right side, Porzingis. Just five to shoot. Beal. Goes back up. And it's Porzingis. Hey, it in. Porzingis has got eight points. And talk about persistence. Porzingis just being a bully on the offensive glass. And punishing the opposition. And Philadelphia decides to take their first time out right here. And Coach is looking to seize every advantage, maximize every possession. Critical part of the game. You have to be flexible. You have to be able to adjust what you're doing. Looking at who's out there now for the Wizards. Hachimura, he's checked in for Kyle Kuzma. Avdia comes in for Kispert. And it's Will Barton in for Beal. Here's Barton. Sinks the three-pointer. And good to get him going early. Yeah. That shot should give him some confidence. When he's feeling good, he can help you stretch the defense a lot. He's more for three. Rebounded by the Wizards. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in the first quarter. Damian Lee. First person. This is his first free throw of the game. Team foul. At the line for your home team, Will Barton. First free throw is good. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. 141 left to play in the first quarter. 
Here's Embiid. Green breaking loose. Embiid, the pass to Green. The shot's good. Green. A little artistry in the painted area, converting against the size. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. Morris with the bucket. They have been excellent so far, coming in with a well-balanced attack. And it's helped them build an early lead. They just need to stay aggressive. Assist goes to. Nice there, Giddy. The reverse. Love that. And, and the fans got a little bit of a show there. Guys, that one definitely had a little something extra on it. Morris kicks to Barton. Pass to Abdiya. Now here's Porzingis. Down low. Here's Barton. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Barton's got seven points in the game. Yeah, they, they have gone full throttle from the opening tip, showing no signs of letting up. Already ahead by double digits, trying to run away and not look back. Now, here's Avdia. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Here's Green in the hoop for his third make from the field. He's three for four thus far in the contest. Yeah, and there it is again. On a lot of their possessions this first half, they've established great inside position. Yeah. We're seeing some fireworks from them already. They established the pace. They made shots. This is why they're way out in front. That one is good from Joel Embiid. And the strength of Embiid oftentimes just overwhelms the defense. Able to absorb physical coverage and still finish. A big-time effort for Porzingis, providing a lot of energy for Washington. He notched eight points in the quarter and has that terrific basketball. The visiting team. And welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And before we move on, what do you guys think about what we've seen so far from the Wizards? I love their effort, contesting shots, trying to intimidate here early on. And you can see it's already having an impact. It can cause shooters to think twice. So on the floor for Philadelphia, we've got Aaron Gordon, also Matthews out there, and it's Christopher in at the two-guard spot. There's the pass to Kuzma. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Kuzma's got his first bucket in this one. Solid at fighting through contact. I like how Kuzma accepts these challenges and converts them. And they've repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. And that was the mobile one drive. Well worth a second look. His team is down, but with the way he went at the rim, you know they'll keep fighting the entire game. Now here's Beal, defended by Looney. And the dunk by Porzingis. Super work on the boards. Boy, they really want to put their foot down on him now. Yeah, and once you got him on the rope, Greg just keep swinging away. You know why? Because this defense is reeling. They had to stop there but couldn't secure the rebound. They're still looking for answers. Washington leading now by seven. Pass to Kispert. And here's Kuzma. Launches a three. Kept alive by Washington. Beal the pass to Kuzma. Passes to Porzingis. And the dunk by Porzingis. He's getting it to this man. I mean, once Porzingis catches fire, there is no putting that out. And a player opt-out for Kyle Kuzma after this season. G.A. probably hoping to earn himself a raise. Yeah, and he's a worker looking to round out his game and take that next step as he's just entering his prime. And Matador defense, that's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see. And this is what happens when you start to break your opponent's spirit. The resistance is no longer there. Here's Gordon. No good with the layup. Outside, Beal. 
pulls up. Again, the Wizards score. And the concentration Beal has while shooting. I don't even think he notices the defender. Gordon. That doesn't go either for Gordon. And so it's Beal. He'll bring it up for Washington. This is the most they've led by 13 points. He uses the glass to finish the way. Beal's got four points this quarter. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. This has been an impressive performance tonight. Even with a big lead, they maintain their focus. And a new group getting ready to come in for Washington. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Porzingis. Hill comes in for Kyle Kuzma. Davis is checked in for Kispert. And Barton sub in for Beal. Two minutes remaining in the second quarter. Two Here's Green, and he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. He's Smitty one way. Javante Green got our attention early on in his career. Was with his spectacular acrobatics, those great dunks. Kevin, I agree with you. Reverse jams, windmills, putbacks. There isn't going to be a soft finish when he's close to the bucket. Morris, no good. Philadelphia trails by 14. Here's Sumner. Boom, he kicks it straight down. And that's a little lack of fight at the defensive end. Uh, absolutely. At least on that slam, you're right. That's one way to let a team back in the game. Yeah, defensively, your mantra at this point has to be no easy buckets. Barton, no luck. It's stolen by Morris. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played, good. Man, haven't we seen that a few times today, guys? I mean, their defense has got to have a little bit more toughness about it. Davison, the pass to Hernan Gomez. And he banks in the lane. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. So timeout called here, the first for the Wizards. Gomez against Gafford. There's 48 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Shot clock at six. Martin, wide open. He fires. The Wizards with another miss. Philadelphia trails by 12. To the middle. Here's Davison. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Monte Morris. And really, the first, defense first foul in there to prevent the layup, Second but that's exactly back. what you need to do. Philadelphia shooting their third and fourth free throw shots Davis of the night. In. Two shots. No good on that. Washington making some changes. Carries checked in. And Abdiya subbed in for Davis. Philadelphia also making some changes. Joel Embiid, he's checked in for Hernan Gomez. Ken Bazemore comes in for Max Drews. And it's Damian Lee in for Edmund Sumner. To Abdiya. There's 18 seconds left to play in the first half. And now Philadelphia on the break. And Bazemore kicks to Green. Embiid, the pass to Green. That's good, and that's Embiid with the assist. Green's got it back down to within single digits for Philadelphia. He can't get it to go. And so it's Washington in control with a nine-point lead to end the quarter. And they've done a phenomenal job. We played through the first half. Plenty of basketball, though, left in this one. And it's been a clinic out there by Kristaps Porzingis. In those first two quarters, he was pretty much an automatic bucket getter if he got it down low on the block. I have to credit them for their patience offensively. They understood the matchup, and they took the necessary time to exploit it. Kuzma will step in at the four, with Porzingis at center. Morris and Beal are the guards. And it's Kispert in at the small four. And that's the group starting the second half for Wes Unsell Jr., to Morris. 
and he finishes nicely on the way. Morris has got 10 points in the game. Terrific play call to give him a clean look at the rim. That's how you want to start the second half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. Great timing. That could be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Kispert, the pass to deal. Kispert with it. Fires the three. They get it again for Zingas. Second shot opportunity, and it's good on the way. 14 points for him. And because he can score from all over the floor, Porzingis can find space inside. That's not the case for most seven footers. Gordon finds Matthews. Safety move. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. Philadelphia shooting their fifth and sixth First free throws foul. of the game. Shooting for the away team. Wesley Matthews. Free throw. Good. Matthews. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Washington. Both free throws good from Matthews. Wizards leading by seven. Here's Morris. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Aaron Gordon. It's going to be on Aaron Gordon. For Washington, they have gone two for two in the game at the line. Shooting for your home team. Montaigne Morris. First free throw is good. At the line for two. And Morris drops them both. Here's Highland. He has six. And we're just about a minute and a half into the third quarter of basketball. That's a shot the defense looked like it was willing to give up. Big mistake. Morris passes to Kispert. Beal taking his time here. Now, here's Morris. He's guarded closely. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And this is his second trip to the line in the game. Free throw good for Morris. And the Wizards making a change here. Gill's checked in. Hernan Gomez is checked in for Philadelphia. Max Struess comes in for Wesley Matthews. Struess's shot is good. And, and you got to love the big bucket in the paint in this sort of a grinded-out game. Morris outside. The pass to Gill. Nice ball movement by Washington. Outs pass from Beal. Gill kicks to Beal. Down to five on the shot clock. It's hauled in by Gordon. Philadelphia trails by six. Pass to Struess. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Struess. Struess has got his second bucket. And that's almost automatic anytime he can get the ball in that position. Morris dishes to Beal. Passes it to Kispert. Outside Beal. Pass to Morris. Let's the three fly. And again, Washington, no good. And their offense is really clicking right now. Playing with a lot of energy and really taking it to the defense. The feet to Beal. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. Out left to the wing. Here's Christopher driving inside. And some kind of switch must have been flipped at halftime because both teams are getting after it. I would have loved to hear the coach's speech because they really took heed to it. Like you said, both teams playing at a different pace. Washington calls timeout. And coach can't like what he's seeing, trying to get them refocused. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. And a new group getting ready to come in for Washington. Carey's checked in. Hachimura comes in for Gill. Avdia's checked in for Kispert. And Barton subbed in for Beal. Avdia can't hit. Green against Hachimura. And the pass to Embiid. Back to Green for the tie. 
That shot off. Now the Wizards take it the other way. Now here's Barton. He's guarded closer. Pass to Avdia. Morris outside. Passes it to Carey. Shoots over Embiid. The Wizards with another miss. Knocks it loose. Pass to Sumner. Over to the left wing. Here's Davison. He nails it. And we're tied up. And you talk about fighting your way back into a game. They've shown a lot of grit in this comeback. Tremendous composure on display. When they were down big, they did not panic. They just stuck with the game plan. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Martin surveying the floor. To end the drought. He takes it up and lays it in. Martin's got nine points. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. And that one's good. Green. Here's Barton. Nine points in the game so far. Off target. And so after three quarters of play and some great offensive output, this one is time. And time to step aside. The away team. Now let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. Yeah, and and I, I like the fact we get to see this pass one more time. A magnificent feed. And you love to see your off guard taking over the playmaking duties with this much skill. Very unselfish. If you appreciate teamwork, this is the kind of play that will get you up out of your seat. Three tens, quarters behind us. One more to go. Thanks for being with us as we begin the fourth. So on the floor for Philadelphia. Gordon out there with Looney. Then it's Matthews. And it's Christopher in at the shooting guard. Davis against Matthews. And the shot goes down. Matthews has got it all tied up now for Philadelphia. And how about the grit and determination in the post? I mean, essential qualities to have late in a close game. Davis finds Porzingis. Now Beal. Right block shot. Tries again. Here's Porzingis. And even after two offensive rebounds, they just can't get the lid off. the pass to Highland. Pass to Christopher. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. And so it's Beal. He'll bring it up for the Wizards. And Davis can't get it to go. Here's Philadelphia. Looney passes to Gordon, and it's Gordon finishing it off. A constant threat around the rim. Gordon is an agile big who just throws it down with ease. Outside, Beal. They throw line jump shot. Highland with the rebound. Beal's gone 3 of 10 shooting so far, only 30%. Here's Matthews. Looney passes to Matthews. Outside Gordon. Fires for three. Rebounded by the Wizards. Persingas has got eight rebounds in this game. Beal the pass to Kuzma. And Kuzma slams it in. And we continue to see Beal improve as a playmaker. Beautiful pass there. Got a piece of Rozingas with the steal. Deal with it. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. The thing is, you want to do everything you can to help your team. And sometimes you just try to do too much. An aggressive move and fantastic finish. Trying to send a message with that slam, I think. Time called here. The Wizards decide to talk it over. And now. Let's take a look at the new balance player of the game. 
Kristaps Porzingis. And in terms of his shooting, this has been one of the more accurate performances you'll ever see. I mean, he's been in constant motion, creating a lot of good looks for himself. But, but still, even when you're wide open, you expect to miss some of the time. That has not been the case here tonight. This guy has made everything. And the wait is now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. I was able to listen in on what Wes Unsell Jr. had to say to the team. This is still a close game, and he told us, guys, we're not far away. We can still get this one. If we seize the moment, we can walk away with the win. Thanks, David. Yeah, big call there on the goal team. He just didn't get to it soon enough. Boy, that's a tough break. And Philadelphia has possession. So far in the fourth quarter, they've allowed just six points. Looney passes to Highland. Standing the floor. Over Kispert. And right on target. Good. Matthews has got the lead up to two now for Philadelphia. They've been trailing for a few minutes. So that could change right here. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. It's all about Porzingis' accuracy. That's what will make or break him here. All right, well, look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for Philadelphia. Smart ball handling from them in this one. Passing around to get ahead of the defense and putting it in the hands of ready shooters. And during this game, now they sliced the D apart by just attacking the rim. A flat out dominating them inside. Three for Matthews. Rebounded by the Wizards. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. To the paint, stolen by Gordon. Matthews against Morris. Now here's Matthews. D right on him. It yeah. counts. That is world class. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. And that was another look at the fantastic Mobile One drop that happened a moment ago. And it's all about the ability to get two feet in the paint, whether it's creating for a teammate or for yourself. Here's Beal. A second chance effort. Here's Kuzma. They had a number of cracks in it, but came away empty-handed. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now again and again. And they're not in the penalty yet. First yeah, you know what? Smart foul. you got to try and extend the game. Getting another opportunity here to see that powerful rejection. Quick thinking pays off big. What a block. And Philadelphia has possession. Giving up just eight points in the fourth quarter. Third personal foul. Right on the first, and that makes it a three-point lead. At the line for the away team, Bowens Island. At the line for two. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a four-point ballgame. Nice job extending the lead and making this a two-possession game now. Time called here. The Wizards decide to talk it over. They're trailing by four. 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Twenty seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Morris, and it's Looney with the rebound. And they need to stop the clock, so there's a foul. Fourth personal foul. Third team. And the first of two, no good. Heartbreaker. At the line for the away team. Kevin Looney. Two shots. No luck that time either. Beal, that's for two. And again, Washington, no good. So they foul intentionally. Kisper, first personal foul. He hits the first one, foul. and that puts them up by five. Shooting for the away team. And so he drops them both. It's a six-point ball game. There's the knockout blow. No chance of getting up off the canvas now. And here's Morris for three. No good there. So Philadelphia wins it. This was a hard-fought, well-earned victory for him, Greg. They really had to work for this win. That's a good point. I mean, we can see this might have been at the end with the crowd amped up, everyone in the building kind of rooting against you. But they stood tall and pulled it out. Well said. And that'll do it, folks. For Steve Smith, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge.
This is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. We'll see you next time.